What's up, everybody? Welcome back to Flicking on My Big Tarot, here where I bring you the beauty, juice, and spiritual truths. I'm your spirit guide host, Miss DC. And today, you guys, we are back with another general re-end for the sign of Pisces. Please understand this will not apply to every single Pisces, as every single Pisces is not going through the same scenario. Cross watchers, anybody outside the Pisces energy, you're more than welcome to join in, tune in, but please utilize this information for the most positive purpose. Spirit told me to talk to you, so I will be talking to you guys with a few of my tarot decks, including the one that I created myself. So excited, okay? For more information, everything will be in the description box below. Without further ado, Pisces, I'm talking to you, okay? I'm excited. Make sure you like, share, and subscribe to this video. And if this is so, drop a tip in my cash up. Leave me a comment and let me know. Pisces, what we got? I love reading for y'all. Y'all are my favorite sign to read for. I don't know why, but I just, I love y'all. Maybe it's because you're right after Aquarius. So change. May, I feel like off the break, you need to change something or you're going to change something. You're in the process of changing something. You're on a move. You might be moving from one apartment to another, or I feel like you might be moving to a nice place. You might be moving to a nice place. Official person. Yeah, I feel like you upgrading. Kind of let me upgrade just is what I got. The type of energy that I got. I feel like you are in a boss energy. You're in a really good position and you need to live like it. You're in a great position and you need to live like it. So I feel like something is changing. I feel like you're changing a position also. Maybe you're going to go from this. Maybe you went from an assistant manager to manager or maybe even higher than that, the director. Ooh, stabbed in the back. I feel like somebody stabbed you in the back, literally. Like, possibly emotionally. Like, somebody might have actually stabbed you in the back. Somebody might have slit your tires. That's why I feel like, okay, so now the energy is changing a little bit. I feel like you have to move from where you were because there might have been some domestic violence. So now you have to move. Yes, Phoenix. Um, new phase, rekindle, renew, transformation, growth, change of mind. I feel like maybe you're you got out of a situation and now you blossomed into something better. So it's like this this might have been your old situation. Now you're in your new situation. Like maybe you had to move because um somebody fucked you up or some shit like that, and then you had to get better, and now you in a better place, and it's like you know what, what the fuck ever. Like, stop playing with Pisces like that. Pisces going to get it regardless. <laughs> you don't got to worry about a motherfucking Pisces. A motherfucking Pisces going to get it. That's that water, that true water sign energy. I will give it to the water signs. Y'all might not always. Well, I know cancers do really well with money. Okay, Scorpios and, 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 and Pisces, I don't really know about y'all and money, but y'all be having it though. I feel like y'all be having it. Get that any project you engage in to be well worth your while. I feel like you're transforming, you're turning into something new, you're doing something different. You got a new position, and whatever position it is will be well worth your while. That's good, Pisces. See, that's what I'm talking about. Y'all be having some some wicked shit going on, but it'd be so beautiful. Y'all be having some shit going on. Consider the advice of a friend, but make your own decision. Okay, so I feel like maybe something happened between you and somebody else and you went to go seek guidance from a friend or maybe um, you want to talk to somebody who you classify as a friend and it says consider the advice but make your own decision. So you can hear what they say and, and without actually taking heed. Unless you want to take heed to it, you have the option. Don't let nobody peer pressure you. Oh, you need to leave them because they're no good for you. Like that's not none of their business at that point. You know what I'm saying? It's like, okay, well, you know, you have the choice. You can stay or you can leave. Let them keep it at that. If they got to say anything else, it's like, oh, nah, like I got my own decision to make, but I appreciate your advice. So yes, 
Let's go ahead and get into the tarot with my tarot card. Y'all, I'm so excited about this shit. It's not even funny. I'm so excited. I'm so excited. All right. Pisces. Let's see what we got, Pisces. All right. Okay, we got the scale. We got the scale. We got the scale. Okay, something is going to go in your favor. Okay, look at that. I, I designed all of the um, illustrations on these cards. So this is literally the handwritten, the original hand right, handwritten drawing. And I just put it on a card, but I think this is so cute. It looks like an actual scale. This side is broken, but yeah, this is the scales. So um, something is going to be going in favor for you, I feel like. This moving process might go in your favor or something related to it might go in your favor. Um, yeah, I feel like you, something is gonna go in your favor, but you're gonna have to lose something. So you may have to lose your place in order to gain something else. So it's like, if you, you might win a good amount of money due to whatever happened, and now you can move somewhere else. So you can drop the place where you was and move somewhere else. So it's like something is going in favor for you. So just, yeah, like something that's going to make you happy, something that's going to make you emotionally satisfied, something is just going to, I feel like you're nurturing your own needs at this point by doing this. I feel like you're nurturing your own needs by doing this. Oh, spirit. <laughs> spirit is giving me downloads and I'm understanding it only the way I know how. <laughs> And it's so cool. All right, so we have, okay, the star strand in reverse. So I feel like even though you're happy, you're still kind of um, not so hopeful about a situation. I feel like it's still kind of, it's still making you sad. It's still making you feel like maybe there's no hope for something else. Um, I want to be happy. I am happy, but yet I'm really not it's like I'm happy in one sense, but in another sense, it's like I'm out of a toxic situation, but at the same time, I'm not in a relationship kind of ordeal, like sad to let something go. Yeah, you're keeping your feelings a secret. I feel like you might be keeping this move a secret. You might even move out of the house and this person not even know that you're going to do that. Like, I feel like you might move out. Of, you might move out of the house and not tell um, the person you're going to do that. Look, five of swords in reverse. I feel like you're trying to, if you let something go, like, if you just let something go, it'll go in favor for you. Like, don't force anything. Don't fight anything. Just, you know, just let whatever this situation is go and you'll be happy. Yeah, you'll still be sad, but you'll be sad in, 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 in secrecy. You know what I'm saying? You'll be sad by yourself, which it's not always fun, but it's like, at least you ain't in that toxic ass shit. You know what I mean? So it's all right, Pisces. Y'all are this shit. Oh, uh, see, it's gonna hurt you a lot to let go of something. But everything is fine. Everything is going to be fine. I feel like it's something is gonna pinch just a little bit. Yeah, I feel like something is gonna pinch just a little bit. But everything is going to be fine. That's what I get. And that's what I'm going to title this. It's going to pinch just a little bit. Hold on, y'all. And this might be literally, something might literally pinch just a little bit, but you're going to get a gain out of this. You're going to gain independence. You might be stacking your money, saving your money. You might be... Um, getting dirty a little bit like you might be outside washing your car or planting or I feel like you're just outside taking in you know the energy you might be in a garden or starting a garden um 
but I feel like you still, you just, you feel, un, you still feel unnurtured though. Does this is right underneath that star in reverse. Like we got the star in reverse and we got the emperor. I feel like you're not feeling yourself. Like you're feeling like, I mean, I'm independent. I'm beautiful as fuck and I got it. So why do I not feel like how I look? I look good, but I don't feel like that, <laughs> you know, and it's kind of like, you know, you look good, but you don't feel, you know what I'm saying? Like, you feel like, damn, it, like when you know you about to go and get your blood drawn, and I'm only saying that because I'm a phlebotomist, but it's like when you go and get your blood drawn, and it's like you be working yourself up, and then you get that pinch, and it hurts a little bit. And then afterwards, it's like, it really wasn't that bad, but it hurts like shit. You know what I'm saying? Kind of ordeal. So I kind of get that energy right now. Or you might be looking at somebody who feels that way. That might be what it is. If it's not you, because I feel like you're in your energy, but you're looking at someone like they're beautiful, but they're unnurturing. They're attractive, but they're unnurturing. And I think it's this person. Whoever is up here, um, whoever this is up here that you were letting go of or dropping. Yeah, I feel like the, the, the secret is you don't feel like you have strength to move away from this person, maybe. Maybe you don't feel like you have the strength to move away from this person. But whoever it is, I feel like we got the moon card and we got the strength card in reverse. You're hiding the fact that you feel weak. You're hiding the fact that you feel weak. And you know what? You shouldn't. If you don't, you better. 